Welcome. Thank you for joining us here today with Art with Uti. I'll give you a little short background so you have an idea that I'm just not doing little doodly here. Um, I started doing artwork formally when I was a bit older than I am in high school, but I was taught by my mother and my grandmother at a very young age doing what they call local style of art, mainly like tapa making and LA and so forth. But my passion has always been with scenery and the garden itself. And this painting that's behind me at the moment is a representation of my passion, which is a particular type of plant here in American Samoa. It's actually what we call here the avapui, but I've actually morphed it into something that's a little bit different because it is true, but there's also a little fantasy part to it. As it starts off as your typical avapui, but then it grows into something different and it opens up and it starts to pretty much blend in like cotton, if you will. It's like feathers. So it's actually blowing in, in the wind. And when I started this, this painting, I didn't really have a vision. It was more what I wanted to just see what I could do. And the colors started off very dark and then it ended up being this vibrant red hue that you can tell in this in the beautiful leaves or the flower itself which is part of the whole painting but the background has its dark hues that was i would say it wasn't really intentional but it ended up being that way as i was making it and i think that's what makes this piece very special what i would like to ask is that i haven't named it yet but if you out there feel that you could help me I would really like to hear from you. Give me what you think that you would like to call this painting or how it makes you feel. For me, it is my inspiration of my art, inspiration of my little garden, and the flower that I adore so much. Again, this is Art with Uti in American Samoa. Thank you very much.